Bakın duruşum. <gülüyor> <gülüyor> Hi guys, welcome to 3 Minute John. And now the news. The foldable smartphone is coming. In two weeks, we might get the most revolutionary device the human race has ever seen. Or not. We might just get a useless, overpriced device that nobody wants. Samsung posted on Twitter last week a short video for the 2018 developer conference and in it they showed a subtle graphic of two lines unfolding that look a lot like a foldable phone. And that's it. That's, uh, that's the whole thing. I mean, it might just be graphic that has nothing to do with a foldable phone. But Samsung CEO DJ Ko hinted last month that the foldable phone might be coming this year. I'm not so excited about the phone as I am excited about the tech behind it. Will the screen bend on the inside or on the outside? Will it be a continuous display panel? Or will it have a hinge between two panels? Will I ever get 10,000 subscribers? And on top of that, Samsung is working on a foldable laptop. But uh, laptops already fold. You know? Yeah, but this one might just be a whole display that folds. But then, wouldn't it be a foldable tablet? Will it still have physical keyboards? Again, will it have a hinge between the two panels? Will it fold in two or in three? Will I ever get the 1000 subscribers plaque? <laughs> I... <laughs> I'll make a cardboard one just for me. Oh! <laughs> you son of a <laughs> So there's gonna be a lot of folding in the near future. Fold, 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 fold. <laughs> The blockchain smartphone. Back in May, we talked about HTC's first blockchain smartphone that will be the ultimate device for cryptocurrency enthusiasts. And now the Exodus One is ready for pre-order. First of all, it's a phone with flagship specs, a six inch Quad HD plus display, a 3500 milliamp battery, IP68 wire resistance, dual main cameras with 16 and 12 megapixels, dual eight megapixel front cameras, Snapdragon 845 processor, six gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of storage. And on top of that, it's made specifically for crypto traders and it can secure your crypto wallet keys, giving them extra protection against hacks. Now, the phone is not exactly what they promised back in May because it doesn't have the cold storage option that would make possible to keep your coins offline away from hackers. The phone is ready for pre-order and it will ship in December just in time in case Santa wants to bring some holiday crypto and you can only buy it using Bitcoin or Ether. It will cost 0.15 Bitcoin or 4.78 Ether, which is about $960 at this time. But who knows how much it will cost tomorrow. It's as unpredictable as Kanye West. If he don't look good, we don't look good. This is our president. It's true. He has to be the freshest, the flyest, the flyest planes. Well, maybe Santa will bring him some holiday therapy. No more notch. Yep, Samsung really wants to be on top of the game. Besides from foldable phones and laptops, they plan to make a smartphone with true bezel-less display. Now I know that Oppo already made it with the Find X and Vivo with the Next, but they did it by making cameras pop out of the phone. And we all know that in the long term, moving parts in a smartphone is a really bad idea. But Samsung has presented last week at a private meeting in Shenzhen, China called AMOLED Forum, the technologies that will be implemented in the Samsung displays. Things like in-display fingerprint scanners, touch sensitive areas, bone conducting audio, and underscreen cameras. What? Underscreen cameras. Well, that's alien technology right there. Now, there is no prototype yet, just some PowerPoint slides, but they said that the way it works is that the pixels in front of the camera will become transparent when you use the selfie cam, but otherwise will function like normal AMOLED pixels. And I find myself in this type of technology because when you look at me, you can see the Greek god body that I have under this thick layer of fat. If Samsung pulls this through, giving us a true bezel-less display and skips the whole notch drama, they will have my everlasting love. La telenovela especial, tres minutes Juan. 
<laughs> My notch disease has spread it to all Android smart telephones. Soon, todos el telephones will have my notch. <laughs> no! Samsung, si. Sí. Yo no tengo el notch. Yo tengo underscreen cameras. No! Si. Sí. No! Si. Sí. No! La telenovela especial, tres minutos, Juan. This was the show. Thanks again very much for watching. Remember to subscribe if you haven't. Leave a comment below. Share this with your friends. Follow me on Instagram, on Facebook. I'm John. Until next week, keep it safe and secure. Cheers. And happy Halloween, everyone. La telenovela especial, tres minutos, Juan. No. Si. No. Si. But will you keep el headphone jack? No lo sé. Ha 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 